favorite today in my life. I love to write. Mm -hmm. I love to broadcast. Uh, the concept. So you of don't a, consider the concept, this work? You consider no. The, the concept enjoy. of actually retiring frightens me mm -hmm. because I don't know what I do. If I, if I because you I have can't, an amazing I can't voice. Run, you're not going to. I can't run. I, I, I can't run a marathon voice. anymore. I, I can still walk a mile, which I regard as a blessing. But I, I, I need, like for example, you know, I know we're taping right now, but as I leave here, it's down to W. Ellis to cut spots, then over to the United Center to see LeBron James play basketball. That that's my life, and and I and I love it, and it's the only life I really have uh, ever ever wanted, and I feel so remarkably blessed. A along the way, you meet so many engaging people. I mean, you and I having just a tremendous lunch over at Bluegrass today with marvelous people. And by the way, the food at Bluegrass is <laughs> is not to be overlooked. It's a great New Orleans style menu. I mean, it was Thank just you. thoroughly enjoyable. And doing this show, you're it, it's interesting because this is not the traditional show I do. You're, you're the first real interviewer who's talked to me about Buffon in, in human terms, in terms of what are we doing mm -hmm. with these gladiatorial beasts. And the answer is, it's not very pretty. Yeah, it's, it's unfortunate because, you know, we don't know that people don't see sports that way. They, they, they turn it on on Sunday, and it's like um, the media has made it into like... Uh, oh, we glamorize yes, the sport it's, like it's, nobody's business. It's like a glamour type of thing. It's sort of like going to the, to the Academy Awards. In fact, on a Sunday football, and I have a play scheduled, my husband, I think, is going to, you know, <laughs> he's going to, yes, by football, he's going to get it. And God forbid I should talk to him during a game, oh my God, you know, it's Well, like, the game is driven by, by but, violence. Yeah. But, but to a greater degree, pro football and college football is driven by, yeah. hello, <laughs> gambling. Okay. But listen, <laughs> Chet, it's been so, I see my, I see um, that I'm going to have to close the show, and I want to invite we you back. We're just getting warmed up. Yeah, we're getting warmed up. And when you write your next book. On, Which on will the, be on Otis Wilson. On Otis Chicago Wilson. So we'll have a lot more to discuss, and we'll be talking more about what's going on in football and the real stuff about football, not the stuff that you see just on Sunday and your wife, uh, you know, or your husband, you know, gets mad that you're talking, but you're really, you know, behind the scenes.